Welcome back to Let's Play Boktai. It's time to take Garmer back to the pile driver and purify him. Okay, I'm not getting knocked out of the room. Constantly happens to me. I'm not dealing with it this time. Let's use a banana to counteract the slowdown and let's move it. Let's book it. Okay. Hey, sunlight. We could use this. Oh! Something I forgot to mention before, which I probably should mention, is that you can... How do I put this? The batteries in your solar gun all have separate separate tanks. So if I were to use part of my double battery, and then I switch over to my single battery, you see that's a separate tank. So, basically, with the, the double battery and the single battery we have now, I have three ta three tanks to use. Which is mighty helpful when you have uh, bosses and stuff to fight. You need lots of sunlight, or for whatever reason, you just can't recharge fast enough. I'd never recommend this course of action that I'm doing right here, because these golems will own you. But, for the sake of getting this done quickly, let's just book it. Ah. Okay, I don't want to die here because of your chlorophyllin. But I will, unless I heal myself. Let's run. Ah, we need another banana. Run! That chlorophyllin's still freezing me, but it goes away. There you go. And I got knocked by this thing. Whatever. Next room! Okay. We want to go up here, I believe. Ah, man, I alerted that box. Ah, well. Just keep running past it. For the sake of Let's Play, I'm just trying to get through this dungeon quickly. Otherwise, I would be totally taking my time and totally stealthy and killing everything in sight, and I'd be sweet. But... Unfortunately, I'm running on a 11-minute time limit because of YouTube. Ah, well. Let's book to the pile driver. We are right here. Just going through this room. There you go. It's time to purify Garmin. All right. Set the coffin on the pile driver. Yo, um, uh, what's Garmer doing? A snowstorm? That can't be good. Now we can't start the pile driver. Across the ice floes. At the start of this dungeon. Wasn't there an open area? Looks like you'll have to take the coffin there. If you could take care of the ice above, maybe we could do it here. Yes, unfortunately Garmer has frozen the uh, the hole in the ceiling that was giving the pile driver the sunlight we need. Unfortunately, we now have to backtrack to the beginning of this dungeon to uh, so use another pile driver. However, if you had done the fire dungeon before this one, you would have the flame lens for your Gundel Sol, and you could melt the ice above. I ha I chose to do this one first, as I always have every time I played this game. So I'm used to having to go back to the beginning of the dungeon. Let's use a banana. I don't. I can't remember ever seeing anyone do the fire dungeon first, actually. I don't know why. No one likes to do the fire dungeon first. Uh, yeah. Let's bring the coffin up here. This is the, by the way, this is the, uh, other, other entrance to the dungeon from the other side of the ice flows. So in case you're wondering what that side looked like, now you get to see. 
Okay. Up here is where we want to go. But as you will soon see... Ah, damn it. Uh, you're supposed to fall down this hole, but I fell down the wrong hole. So, give me a second. There you go. Just to save a little time, I fell down the right hole for you. There's like four holes up in that place where we fell. And you just want to fall down the one furthest to the right. And if you, fell, if you fall on the one furthest to the right, you get that silver coin. If you fall second farthest from the right, you end up up here and you can recharge your sunlight. But I prefer the silver coin. Anyways. <clears throat> We're almost to the first pile driver. So let's just book it. Shall we? Use a banana. Oi. Uh, don't particular, particularly want to deal with golems right now, so let's just run past them. Oh, it looks like a couple of them smashed into a wall. Yay, no more slowdowns. The banana actually does its job and runs real fast. Just wide enough. Here's the pile driver. It's finally time to do this for real. Set up the, power, the solar stations. And get ready. Ready to say it with me? Three, two, one. Tayo! Let's fight. Garmer is an easy purification boss. All his only attack is this little ice breath thing. Incredibly easy to dodge. Just stay as far back as you can, and you should be fine. If he does hit you, he'll freeze you and slow you down. The only annoying thing about this is that his ice breath can also freeze solar stations. Which means that they can't shoot sunlight at him, which means you can't kill him as fast. Like he's been... Come on. Come on. I need to power up the solar station. Good. Okay. This shouldn't be too hard. He might freeze one of our solar stations here. I don't think I've ever gone past this boss without being without one of them being frozen. But maybe we'll get lucky. Pop up on our life. Run over here. Recharge this one. Yes, he is freezing that solar station. The jerk. If you have the flame lens, you can melt this and then get it back online faster. If you don't have it, just wait it out. It'll suck, but that's all you can do. Ow. I don't want to be frozen. Come on, die. Urgh, gotta get over there. Damn you. Yes! Back online. All four. Let's do this. He's on his last legs. Just try and outrun the ice and keep your solar stations at uh, full power. And you'll have them in no time. So close. Yeah! What? Time to spare. A rank. Booyah! Got Frost 1 Solar Gun Lens. And one seal's broken. One Dark Seal is gone. We have one more Guardian to purify. East, Django. East we will go. Let's continue. We've got a little bit of time. The solar tree is calling, I think. When you get that message, that means the solar tree's fruit that you planted is ready to be picked. Let's go do that right now while we got the time. Yes, yes, I'm in this dungeon. Teleportation! I love teleporting. So useful. Run through another dungeon. Deserted arsenal. 
teleport. And out the dungeon we go. Back to the solar tree. Booyah. There you go. Yes, our solar fruit is ready. Got one of the solar fruit. Eel fruit. This is not a life fruit, unfortunately. But what it will do is fully heal you if you use it. Pretty good item to have. Oh. Uh, we're about out of time. I'll see you next time on Let's Play Boktai. The sun is in your hand. Later.